So hello guys, today we are going to install the NV graphic mod along with the config graphic mod and also the DLSS mod. So all the Patreon link will be in the description. So make sure you check it out. First, we are going to install the NV graphic mod. So this is the graphic mod over here. To install it, you need to start your open IV and to go over here and make sure you select the part here uh, and zip the graphic mod. Okay. So this is the NV part one OIV. So it will be easy to install. Now click on install mods folder and install. So we have successfully installed the part 1. We will do the same process for the part 2. Okay. Select the file. Click on open. Make sure you install into your mods folder. And confirm the installation. So we have also ensured the part 2. That means we have successfully ensured the NV main graphic package. Now we are going to ensure the optional add-ons. Okay. From here we are not going to install everything. Only the certain add-ons. Okay. Like the NV roads. Make sure you select the OIV. And click on open. Install. Mods folder. Install. After installing the road, we are going with the NVE reflections, okay? So high quality reflections over here. Open it and then click on install. Okay, you just select the OIV, install it, games folder, install. We are done with the reflections too. Now we are going with the vegetation over here, extra vegetation. Make sure you install this too. Click on install, mods folder, install. After that, we are going with the game config. We need the NV game config. Make sure you install it. Install mods folder. Install. So that's all folks. We are done with the NV installation package. Now we are going to install the Confi. And for volumetric clouds, we are going to use the Confi volumetric clouds. Because Confi clouds are all of the weather. So it will be better to use the Confi clouds. Now select the path. You need to go onto your base file. Select the UIV. And make sure you install it. After installing the base file of Confi, you need to go into the Confi installer. Okay. So this is a config install. Make sure you install it. Install mods folder and install. Like I said, first you need to install the NV, then the config, so that config graphics will replace the NV graphic mod. We'll be using all of the NV contents, but for the graphic and visuals, we'll be using the config visuals, okay? And the volumetric clouds too. So we are done with the config main graphic pack. Now you can go with the optional presets. We are going with the visual presets and then the brighter nights. Select the OIV and make sure you install it. Now we are going with the Corona light over here. Corona is V3. Make sure you select the OIV. Then click on install mods folder install. Now we are going with the range ops. Of course we are using the config range ops too. It is better than the NV. Like the OIV. And click on install. Now going with the range ops and FS style. Open and now click on install mods folder install. Now going with the Sharpie alternate over here and select the third option which is the countryside plus urban. So this will cover the entire map. Okay. Now the volumetric clouds select the OIV country volumetric clouds install mods folder install. Now from here bright emergency light. Even we are going to use the country bright emergency lights because I enjoyed the country version then the NV version. So make sure you install this too. So finally guys, we are successful in ensured the config graphic too. That means we are ensured the NV graphic along with the config. Now before we ensure the DLSS mod, you need to open your GTA 5 game. Now go on to the settings over here graphics. Then we have to disable these two options. Okay. One is FXAA and the MSAA. Make sure you disable it. Then click on apply and then exit the game. So now we are going to ensure the DLSS mod. So from here, select both the ASR file and drag and drop this into your GTA 5 directory. Now go into your mods folder and from here, select all the file and drag and drop this over here. After that, open NVIDIA console panel over there, manage shady settings and go on to the program settings. Over here, we have to select the gta5.exe file, okay? Make sure you select the file and then go on the below. Over here, vertical sync. Make sure you enable it. This is one of the important steps too. We have to enable it, okay? And then apply and then quit, okay? So we have now successfully installed all the mods, NV graphic, config graphic, and the DLSS. Now start your GT5 game. So we are back here guys and here is the config graphic and you can also check the FPS above. It's on 30 to 35. Now let's get the ENB. This is the config ENB. It is working now. Now press insert or home button. So this is the reshade bar, reshade menu. Here is the DLSS menu too. Now let's enable it and the frame generation. Make sure enable both of it. Now let's check the FPS. See, it jumped from 40 to 110, 90, 80. So it's double the FPS. All of the mods which are installed, it's working now. Uh, which is absolutely fine. This is the NV parallax road. 
Here is the animator billboard and this is the Conti volumetric clouds which look absolutely beautiful and this is the NV animator gas light all are working good so that's how you ensure NV plus Conti graphic mod so I hope this video helped you a lot but I am going to show more of the combo graphic mod in detailed video for that make sure you subscribe the channel till then peace out